Ariana reporting for Kids First, and today I'll be doing a review for the movie The Napping Princess. The Napping Princess takes place in the year 2020, where Coconi dreams of a world called Heartland. But her dad gets kidnapped for stealing technology, so Coconi and her friend Mario must work together to save him. On their adventure, they find out that Heartland holds the answers to saving Coconi's dad. The Napping Princess is such an awesome movie, has an amazing plot because it's basically like a little kid's dream comes true, coming true because it is a kid's dream coming into reality. So I really like that because it was like one of a dream movie for me. And I really liked the name, honestly, because usually the name doesn't tell much about the movie sometimes, but this one really like described it because in her dream she's a princess. So napping princess. I really like that about it. It had an anime vibe to it, you know, like the animation, anime and stuff. And the movie was originally in Japanese, but when it was in English, like the words were completely on time and everything. So that was really cool about it. The only thing that was kind of difficult was uh, sometimes they would like read things or like text and um, they had subtitles underneath, but only for like one specific thing and sometimes you want to know about other things but it only tells you specific things with the English subtitles because the words are in Japanese so that was a little frustrating but that was really it <laughs> that was that was the only bad thing about this movie and my favorite character has to be Joy he's like He's Kokone's little stuffed animal, and then in her, in her dreamland, he's alive and everything, and like that's honestly my dream, to have my stuffed animals come alive. So that was my favorite character. And my favorite scene was when like a robot sprouted wings and like flew, and I really liked that scene, because it reminded me of the commercial for Red Bull. Like, you know, because Red Bull gives you wings. That's my favorite scene. The message of this film is that things aren't always what they seem, but if you look closely, the truth will come out. Um, I recommend this film for ages 7 to 14 because it's basically like an action movie, but in an animated action movie, for more for kids, and I really like that about it, and it was like really such a dream. It's like amazing plot and everything for kids, and I really love that about it too. That's why I give this film a five out of five stars because it was like so amazing. I just don't know, I don't have the words to explain it. It was just so awesome. You can find this movie on DVD anywhere. This is Dariana reporting for Kids First. Bye, thanks for watching.